at Yoruba, and Yoruba, then Ibrahim speaking up, say, go, tell them that there's God within them. They can see God alive. You will say, ah, he's not a Christian. He's not a Muslim. He's not a Shintoist. He's not a Buddhist. Those are just what? Byproducts of confusion. Because mm -hmm. I did not read books to fill the air, to fill water, to see the sun. So whatever that's maybe making me do all these things is because I'm alive. But I don't have connection to it. And I have abandoned my culture, my tradition. So I'm just like, hey, a balloon in the air, anything, it can blow because it has no connection with what the airport. Mm -hmm. So this is what we are saying, that today they should not see me as, because I'm black, I'm this and that, but to prove that civilization started from here. If you go through the books, I've mentioned it, before the invasion of Nigeria, Africa, mm -hmm. Ibadan was the old Nazareth. In Jebu, the old world, Bethlehem. Lagos, oh, just, so just look at their lifestyle in Ibadan here. Mm. We are very hospitable. We care. We give a word. The moment you go beyond that person's boundary, why? Well, we're going to dig in with the person. So today, I'm here now to repeat what happened in the past, to salvage the people from servitude, from slavery, spiritually, physically, and otherwise. Because until man is spiritually connected, science and technology will be a kind of assembly. Are you spiritually connected? Yes, I am. The perfect master. I'm the spirit itself, the Holy Spirit incarnate on earth. You were once arrested? Yes. And charged for murder? Mm, yes. And imprisoned? No. <laughs> Somebody came to our... Don't forget that. When this power manifests, mm. like in this part of the world, where... When you were arrested? Saved, no, I'm coming there, right? So. Whoever comes to debunk whatever they have put down is the enemy number no one. Why? Because we are going to what? Save money, importing radio, mm. TV, books, candles, you name it, telephones. And so this guy got to be a target. They will put everything on his head. And so that's why they came to you. They dropped somebody. Yes. From the mortuary, you can see the mortuary tag on his leg, on his foot. And they came in. They arrested me, went there, they say, hey, this is what is happening. You have to prove your case. We went to court, they took me to court. But they were not able to prove it. And I was standing and acquitted. But I want to tell you, these are all persecutions from the forces of darkness, including Europeans who believe that, no, the black man is not, but I've proved them wrong, that this world is not a cosmic job. Mm. It's this genius of divinity that created it and gave everybody every right Tell me something. Where do you think the Creator will manifest? In a cold country? No. Warm country. The God, God is a warm somebody. He cares. He loves. He believes in everything. Look at I'm not ordinary Yoruba man or black man. Very strong. I mean, a Yoruba man cannot do this. We are beating them to all and what is remaining now is a spiritual coup. Sadhguru Maharaji, is there an end in sight for humanity? There's no end in sight. This world will continue to exist. And for those living in, they have to play a very strong role to make sure that we go and reincarnate back to keep the planet going. Is there hope for Africa? Africa for Nigeria? So, for Nigeria is in the hands of Maharaji. What do you see in Nigeria becoming? 2019, what would the economy look like? Uh, let's talk about now. I don't believe in uh, prophecy. Now, what we need to do now is to reform the education policy, mm -hmm. whereby anybody who comes out from the elementary to secondary school will have known how to repair radio, repair the, the, um, um, the stoves, will be able to connect the wire and say... You know people don't use radio anymore. But, well, radio is going into extinction. Uh, it's not going into extinction. They don't want you to know what is going on. What is That's going why on? they are changing the whole scientific uh, what ways of doing things. So now, two, um, there will be need for we to check up for the government to hands off from all this pilgrimage, pilgrimage because it's sapping the economy. Mm. Right? There will be need. 
for even the churches to pay taxes because they are not